Hi, I'm Maddie Ray, and I want to share an encouraging word with you from Isaiah 41, verse 10. It says this, Fear not, for I am with thee. Be not dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you. I will help you. I will uphold you with the right hand of my righteousness. I want to encourage you with this verse today that there's things in your life right now that is causing you to fear, causing you to be anxious, causing you to be unsure. God's word is telling you right now, fear not. God is saying, I am your God and I am with you. Isn't that a wonderful thing for us to know as Christians that our God is with us? See, we don't serve a God that just tells us to serve him and just we're, you know, devoted to this religion, so to speak, and we just serve this God, but he's a God that's actively involved within our lives. He's a God that helps us. He's a God that doesn't leave us. He's a God that doesn't forsake us. He's a God that gets right there in the middle of our circumstances, in the middle of our situation, in the middle of the mess that we can be going through. Our God is so mindful, considerate, and loving for us as his people. So I want to encourage you to put your faith in this verse, knowing that God is going to uphold you in this time that you're in. Some of you might be watching this right now and you might say, well, I'm actually not going through something that's really hard right now. And maybe there are some of you, you are going through something hard. Whether you're in a situation that's hard pressed or a situation where you're just in a good place right now, God is still upholding you. God is still raising you up. God has still got a hold on your life, helping to lead you into the right place that he has for you. And that's the wonderful promise that we have from our God. So put your faith there. Don't be afraid. Don't be in fear. Trust in the Lord for he is your God and he is with you and he is helping you. Let me pray for you. God, I pray for my friend that's on the other side of this screen. I pray, Holy Spirit, that they are reminded that you are with them. They need not to fear. They need not to worry. They need not to be anxious for you are with them. You are helping them and you are upholding them with your right hand. So we put our faith in that. We trust in you and we thank you, Lord, for all that you are doing in our lives. Continue to lead, guide, and direct us as we go into this day and as we go into this week. In Jesus' name, amen. Well, I hope that encouraged you today. And if it did, then I want you to share this with someone else so they can be encouraged as well. As always, thank you so much for taking the time with me. God bless.